right? What crazy stuff is Jackie doing now? Well, my dear friends, we are going to be braving the internet once again. Because uh, the internet's very temperamental. Because raining sideways here. It is actually raining really, really hard here today. <laughs> it won't stop. <laughs> yeah, it's been pretty impressive. Alright, so we've got 104 hours on this game play through. I'm pretty impressed. Pretty casual. Oh, yeah, just casually 104 hours. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, what's 104? That's only a few days worth, right? <sighs> that's nothing. Four solid days of playing these. Well, no breaks, you know, like no potty breaks. They're overrated. Oh, I'd rather pee myself any day of the week. <laughs> like, oh, I, pee right here. I pee right here now. Oh, gosh. Alrighty, well, what we were looking at was... We are currently on the Killer Island, so there's lots of bearinas, especially the Killer Bearinas. But we have some pretty bad ass nichelings, which are kind of making it look like it's a piece of cake. It's okay, that's a friendly bearina. We went we went through that journey. That's being processed. Killed his parent, and now he's one of us. Don't, that was brutal. That's we, true though. we may have had to go into survival instincts because his mama was a little bit of a bitch. But <laughs> a little bit of a bitch. It was a matter of survival, right? Um, so we've had, I think, now four or five Berina encounters in this playthrough, and two of them were killer Berinas, but we've got some pretty badass nichelings. All you need to do is have an attack stronger than three, and good camouflage for grasslands, and you're fine. If you've got, if you've got five, no, in fact, I think you only really need four. If you've got four camouflage, um when you're next to a killer berina, it can't see you. So you can just hide next to it and keep kind of giving it little love taps. It's tickling. And it makes it really effortless. Yeah. He can't see you. We trialed it. We trialed it in the last one. So we're about to have another baby boom. That's where we're up to. We got a few I've got as many breeding partners as I could get in this generation. If we have any wanderers come in, it's never um, we probably it has become a love <laughs> Oh, that's so bad. Uh, yeah, I guess you could say it has, though. <laughs> I think we've got four breeding partners, so let me see if I can just quickly rearrange my family tree, because mm. it randomizes every mm, time. So clean. Which upsets me just a little bit. Nice. I'm clean. I don't even know if you're in the cam- Oh, no, you are in the camera. Yeah. Just. You've just, you just snuck in. Yeah. Um, Alright, let's see where our breeding partner is. Oh, oh we've got wow. Kara. Oh, cool. She's very cool. She was a wanderer that we came across. She's got What's little tear ducks. So she's wearing a mask. And her like normal colour is this pale colour. Oh. This is her pattern. The orange oh. is actually her pattern. Wow, that's sick. I've never seen one like that before. Yeah, she's pretty cool. So she's got the D in <laughs> the face pattern. But it's very dense by the looks of it. Dense pattern. Yeah, but look at her little sock. Yeah, she's pretty cute. She does have a deformed paw, mm -hmm. but she's just very cute. So usually I, I should be able to pick most of my breeding partners because they will have... Um, I put the genes that I want to keep from them. You've got a good spray of, like, spread of heads there too. Like you've got what, bear in a head, you've got not crack and jaw, you've got poison fangs, you have cat cats. Heads. You have a bird head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do have a random bird. Was that Kimi? Bird, 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 bird. Oh Kimi's my god! With a, cool. Holy, look at that tail. Yeah, Kimi's pretty cool. She's 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 pretty badass. Um, but I'm just trying to organize now our breeding partners. So I've color coordinated them. Blue, pink. Oh, those are pink partners. Yellow. Purple, purple. There's that purple. Let's go purple on the far side there. Um, and then we've got yellow. Oh, that's a lot of yellow. Oh, I was going to try and find a... I want to try and find a partner for Lamia. Um, yellow. Important. Cool cat's pretty cool. Look cool. Um, we've got our pinks. Got our blues there. All right, I'd like to try and find a partner for Lemia if possible. Ranku and Syndrome weren't able to breed with any of these females. 
so that's why these are the guys that are left over but if we have any wanderers come in we'll try and breed them i'm still trying to get the love island <laughs> try and get 10 uh nichelings breeding at the same time if possible oh is that literally what the achievement's called uh it's called spring 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 love or something nice yeah we've got a few achievements to try and so you're gonna have 10 babies on one island no 10 breed 10 times on one day holy shit so i so need, got need, half i need double my breeding yeah you need to have um, 20 initiatives in theory if if i were to do it that way i guess i could partner up some males with other females but I don't like doing that too much. It just means that we might have a lot of niche links at the end of it. We'll see how it goes. Want that. We don't want that apparently. All right. Let's see. We've got a Dodomingo coming. I presume that's what that sound means. We've got some. I don't know. If they've gone. I don't know if they're in or out. They're they're in. They've been scared under. Okay. Um. We've got a friendly fairy in here. This one I think is hanging out. Oh no, this one's coming for this uh, rabble actually. I think I'm pretty down to have a baby boom. A baby boom would be pretty cool. So, we've got Cool Cat on hers. These are other females that are gonna have babies. We've got one here, so I'll pop Cairo there. Then we've got. I don't think we've got any more females over here. We do have Shazza. She is due. Shazza. She's got her nest. And then we've got Kara. Kara, I guess you could probably. Why don't you set yourself up here next to the. or oh, under the oak tree? She might as well go underneath the oak tree. Um, and then I've got one more female somewhere. I think. Do I? Maybe not. Because I think that's it. We've got four breeding females, right? One, two, I'm um, one, two, three, four. Okay, that's all of them. So we'll have some break babies next turn, which will be pretty cool. Alrighty, so we're just still keeping an eye out for any um berryners that spawn. They're gonna cause us some hassle kind of tentatively kind of calling out we've kind of got the friendly bear in here to help but kind of tentative call out for uh, any other surrounding nichelings but these guys are basically just doing a lot of clearing i like like keeping the um nests like still covered just in case we do have any problems with those pesky beariness spawning means our babies have more of a chance if they're tucked in the nest that have coverage. And then these guys, I guess it's just time to kind of keep exploring. See if Lemna can find a uh, little lemon. See if she can find herself a breeding partner. Uh, Rasaya can't eat these berries, but he can show that they're there. Tuck you into the bushes and you can do some clearing around it. Oh, Miki looks pretty cool. Mm. She's pretty cute. Now get her in here. She can do some clearing around there. It's the stripes. She legit has like horizontal stripes. It's so cool. It's a bad ash. And Sally. I guess we can just kind of have Sally go in this way. She can actually smash dash crash this bush. So we might get her to do that. Uh, Ruby can pick from this bush because she's got the poison fangs, so that means she's resistant to the toxins. I don't like leaving any um, meat just sitting around for a day um, on this island type just because it's prone for berryness. Attracting unwanted attention. Yeah, basically. Let's avoid, let's avoid doing that. <laughs> I guess we can have uh, Rank who can just keep a close eye on Kara. She's a little bit out there on her own as a pregnant ma. Um, Rixen, clearing out the space as well. We can get Syndrome to kind of go in and do some more clearing. We're doing pretty good. We've actually cleared a lot of this and we're looking to go into the next island once we've finished, which would be going, oh, we're going to the jungle. 
okay. Um, it looks like we're going to the dangerous jungle. That's going to be interesting. We're going to have to be very, very careful. careful. <laughs> yes. Careful is definitely the word for it. I hope um, this doesn't sound too echoey. I'm gonna have a look for it. I just turned it down a bit. Okay, let's go the next day and let's just see if anything happens. Other than babies! Okay, okay, nothing spawned except for new babies! So, Love babies, high five. Oh my gosh, we got another bird beak baby. <laughs> I, how it's snuck in there between these two it's interesting but blue eyes as well I love the colours <gasps> she's got the scorpion tail he's pretty cool oh. he's very very cool he looks very um, Egyptian god spec very very Egyptian god spec what's, what's a cool um, what's one of the, the cool Egyptian gods there's one that's there's one that's got an eagle face isn't it Oh, there is Ra. Can't remember what Ra, um, what Ra's role is, but that could be pretty cool. Oh, Ra. He oh. looks so cool. He's so cool. Look at his little scorpion head touching, like his tail's touching his head. It's like he can constantly pat himself you on the head. You can give yourself nice scratchy roos. <laughs> nice scratchy roos. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, that's the H gene from there and the I gene. That's very interesting, the genes that have come through there. But let's see how useful they are. So we've got the big ears. We've got our horns, our big eyes. The bird beak coming through again, which is a bit cute. God of the sun. Big body. God of the sun. Mmm, vibe. Um, it's going to be very nimble. Don't think he's going to be able to have a lot of influence on the killer berryness, but... He'll be able to do all the collecting, and he can collect from those poison, toxic berry bushes too, so that's useful. And he's got a little bit of camouflage. It would be better if he had the stripes instead of the spots, but he does have the color camouflage, so he can blend in a little bit. Which you can see here, he gets two color camouflage, and then as long as he's hiding in the grass, he has four. So that means as long as he's in the grass next to a killer berryna, he won't get attacked, he'll be fine. His mum's pretty cool. She's that that's a cool cat. Yeah, blue eyes look sick. Yeah, yeah, it's very fitting. She's cool. She's a cool cat. She's pretty cool. She's a cool she's a cool cat. <laughs> she's a cool cat. She's a legit cool cat. Alright, oh. who have we got? Oh my gosh. There's a little fierce little one here. Oh my gosh. And he's got purple eyes. He's so cool. Boyo. We can keep him as Boyo if you like. He does look like a Boyo. He, he Boyo boy. <laughs> He's boy, really boy, cute. Boy. <laughs> I think he actually just got the exact same genes as Love Ra that. just got. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Even though they've got a um, slightly different line. But he looks really, really Imagine cool. Imagine he feels really warm. Boy, oh boy. Oh, my gosh. Why do you say that? No, it's from, you know, feels really warm. You know, oh, oh boy, yeah, 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 yeah. Very, very I feel very warm right now. <laughs> uh, what is that? That's the Australian love on the spectrum. Mm. So cute. That's so cute. cute. Um, so we've got the round ears on him, which is really, really cute. Uh, cracker jaw isn't particularly majorly useful, but it's not too bad. Um, he's got collecting ability, lots of cracking ability. Um, He's got camouflage, which is going to be super important, but he can't do a lot against killer berryness. So he's going to be more of our gatherer and our explorer, probably. But he looks really, really cute. He's really cool. All these pale colors. His uh, mum is very pale, though. It's basically got the same coloration as Cyro. Cairo, Cyro. I keep shifting which her name was. She's both. Then our sneaky baby in here. Oh, got the savannah horns. You can just see the savannah horns poking through all the grass. Very fitting. Mm. Oh my gosh. Is Miko. The, we've got, we already recently had a Gojo, so we might. Miko. Mo, mi, mocha. Mi, 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 mi. He's, he reminds me of Simba. Ah, it's a boy. Um... 
I'm calling sound like Moja or something. Moja. 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 Mo. You gotta put an E so I like that. Ugh. <laughs> That's better. He's. I love the contrast with these stripes and his green eyes. He's like a little gazelle in this situation. <laughs> so he's got the savannah horns, but the antennae recessive, which is interesting. Keep seeing that kind of pop through. You've got to watch those blind eyes. We'll have to try and get that, breed that out if he ends up being a breeding, uh, if he finds a partner. Um, be good to get that Verena snout coming through. He's got the big body. He's able, he's very nimble with his nimble fingers. He doesn't have a lot of movement, but he can move a little bit. The tail's pretty useless. Um, he's got double chestnut brown fur, so he will blend in really well. So he's not going to be strong enough to kind of take on many of the Verenas. We're not going to have any Verena heads. I think that's one of the, um, kind of, what's the word? disadvantages we're having I think with a lot of these nichelings at the moment but they'll blend in so that's gonna help but he's very cute I love his bright red horns he's super duper cute <laughs> and we've had do we we nearly had four boys in that round but we do have oh wait we're just gonna make sure we double check what genes um, Moja got so we gave the G gene and the home mini so we can get rid of this here and the home mini from Taru. Taru was your dad? How did you not get any of the bear in heads? Oh, Taru was sick. Yeah, he's pretty, he's pretty tough looking. Dog looking guy. Yeah, he's very, very cool. Alrighty, and then we have another, oh my gosh, we've got a kitty cat with big ass ears and the scorpion tail again. That is so cool. Big ears, savannah horns. Um, we've got the purse snout, but the Verena snout recessive. Which I don't mind having a few purse snout because of the healing abilities, but Verena snout would just be helpful to kind of bring forward in the genes. Um, very nimble, very quick, got the scorpion tail. Um, doesn't have the strength, once again, to take on the killer Verenas though. So we've got to be aware of the black eyes on the cat. They look so deep, man. <laughs> uh, but we don't have any camouflage. So L'Oreal is actually going to be, um, she's actually going to be at risk because of her stats, because of her traits. So we'll have to see how that kind of comes together. But that's looking at all our babies. There's been no harm coming through as of yet. So I guess we can just kind of um, carry on as we normally would with our exploration, finding all the food, because we definitely need food. Um, <laughs> but yeah, just doing a little bit of exploring. Uh, Taru, I don't want him to go too far from his partner, so I might pop him to come around here. I think we can actually kind of do some exploring around here. Um, she's good at picking up the nuts, so get her to... She's not in the best spot to pick up the nuts because it's there, but I guess she can just kind of do the clearing around here. We've got Ranku here, who's helping with some of the clearing. Um, Rixen, get Rixen to go further into the exploring. You can kind of clear behind him as he goes. Syndrome's doing lots of clearing. We had uh, our little friendly Verena has uh, snuggled up next to uh, Shaza and her daughter Luriel to kind of help with the uh, uh, protection, especially because she is the most um, vulnerable out of the, the offspring that we just had. So Luriel's got the I and the G gene, so we can get rid of this I gene, the G gene, because I know that they've now been passed on from the parents. Um, Rickson's pretty cool. So we don't want Rickson to go too far from his uh, breeding partner there. Um, that's kind of the same with Brasaya. We don't want him going too far from his offspring mate. No wonder we had a light child. Brasaya is also very, very pale in color. Uh, but Sally can come through and just destroy that bush. None of our nichelings can uh, collect from it anyway because they don't have the um, toxic resistance. So it's kind of like guess no real point in keeping that. We'll have Miki. She looks pretty cool. She might 
find her a partner, who knows. Um, and then here, I guess we can have Cool Cat. She can just kind of clear up around her. Um, we've got Cheaterina here. Cheaterina is going to do some clearing as well. Not wanting to do too much calling out because I think it can encourage um, predators. And I don't think we've got the strongest crew on this side. They're a little bit on the vulnerable end. So just go be wary of that. I think they've some of them do have good camouflage still. Like for example, Kimi, you wouldn't spot Kimi. Not even the normal bearinas can spot her because she just blends in like a ninja. Yeah. <laughs> like Hudson. I don't know, I'd say Hudson's very stunning, <laughs> for sure. Well, we wouldn't even know where he is. Hudson, where are you? He's a big black dog on a white mat. <laughs> He's not planting it at all. Illusion. <laughs> Alright, let's go the next day. See if there's any any dangers that have spawned. Oh, yeah, we've got one over here. Alright. Nothing that we can't handle. It's just a normal berry now. You're so broken. Let's <laughs> <laughs> do the shit <laughs> so much. Oh. You know when you kind of push a bit and it went into my head? I was like, <laughs> I, was like oh, I need to do this. Ugh. Anyway, chat, that's what I did a few seconds ago. <laughs> <laughs> he survived. Because it's like, oh, I told I was like, oh. Oh, no. Anyway. But you survived. Don't eat salmon with seven days old. Everyone. Oh my god. <laughs> such a Even if you are really hungry. You're such a dude. <laughs> if you are really, really, really Don't hungry. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't recommend. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Oh gosh. Even though you do get looked after, it's still not worth it. Man flu, that's what it all wasn't is the about. man flu. That's what it's all about. I that's, see, that's I see. Horse shit. <laughs> no man flu in this. Alright, we've got a I think. I'm tempted to let him like do a swipe and then run back and then he can uh, breathe again with Shazza. I'm gonna be sneaky. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna be like, abort mission! And we run back. <laughs> I'm going to gently push at uh, Luriel. She is a slow baby. She's a bit cute. Kick her out and let her parents. No, no, no. We gently push her out. We're gonna push her out this way so Sorry, she's honey, a little baby. bit we further away. You can only just see you. No, that's my fault. Make sure that we can at least see you a little bit. Put see. some socks on. Socked a little bit. You put some socks I on. I put some socks on. Socks, socks are good. Yeah. Socks are good for me. Right, syndrome. Okay. So why are you tucking your legs up? Do you need a blanket? Me? Yeah. Oh, this is me just attempting to get comfortable because I never feel like I can get comfortable. <laughs> That's silly, um, baby. No. That's yeah. just the way it is. Eating salmon will never be the same. <laughs> That's just the way it is. Such a dude. I reckon Sally might be able to take on this berry now. Because she's going to have enough camouflage when she's... Yeah, I think... I'm going to have her sneak up next to this guy, give him a really good hit, and she shouldn't get attacked because he shouldn't be able to see her. Well, really? Even that far away? Well, because she's got camouflage Holy of seven. Shit. And these Baryanas only have eyesight of five. So because she's more camouflage than they can see, she's she should, Spider-Man. She's, she's just a boss. So she should be able to handle that Berina. I am group. Um, but these guys are going to want to make sure that they stay in Rhyme. bushes. <laughs> Seasons, greetings, and best wishes. He needs them. He's he such needs a dude. Them. Howdy, Ryan. How are you, darling? Oh. Hope you're well today. Weller than uh, this man with uh, man flu is. It's not man flu. It's just stupidity it's flu. It's called eating food that you shouldn't eat flu. It's called... Ooh, I'm a dickhead. I'm a dickhead. Ooh, <laughs> it's, ooh, this salmon's seven days old, but damn, I want it on my salad. Oh my and then still putting it on my salad. And then having copious amounts of fever and headaches all last night. Just for salmon. I was And I, I love my food, and I was questioning ever eating salmon again. I don't know, actually. 
Do no. you have a poopy tummy? I don't actually. It's weird. No, he, which is interesting because he didn't feel sick and he didn't like, like you haven't vomited, you haven't gone and like decided to destroy the toilet. No. You just, he just, just has the just worst myself. headache in the world. He was just reefing in pain on my bed this morning. Yeah, James is, is feeling you as well, man. Yeah. <laughs> don't be a dickhead. Yeah. No matter how hungry you are, don't eat it. <laughs> Bad man. Yeah. Salmonella. Yeah, that's very funny because it was salmon. I think it's quite hilarious. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like, that's so bad. That is so bad. It was, it was so fucked though. Like I've never, I've, I don't really normally get sick at all, and um, this headache is easily by far the worst headache I've had in my life. <laughs> like this thing. You know that whooshy kind of those headaches where you get that whoosh. Take that chance. Food is worth it. Oh, James, you're a bad influence on me, James, brother. you're the worst influence. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> like, I did get a day off out of it, I guess, but still. I don't know if it was a very feel-good day off. No, it was, like I said, I would have rather been at work today, but. <laughs> oh, my God. How was your day anyway, um, James? I've had it twice from the same reporters. You'd think I'd learn. Oh, my God. Portos used to be a jam back in the day. I didn't mind that. Did you ever have a Portos, Jack? I don't think I know what you're talking about. What do you you never had a Portos before. I don't think so. Well, it's a fast food chain, so you'll never have it again. But it's... It's... In, me. It's in Tamworth. It's the closest one. Tamworth and Coffs Harbour, I do believe. Oh. Um, and they, they were kind of like... Australian's version of KFC. Oh. But their burgers are really, really good. I'd, I'd choose an Porto burger. Used to be elite, yeah, used to be. Oh, what have they changed it? That would surprise me. Because I remember um, when I lost my Porto's virginity in Sydney. Porto's virginity. And um, <laughs> me and the boys were looking for something to eat. I'm like, oh, Porto's, let's give a Porto's a crack. It was so good. Now it's super greasy, still yummy, but not the same, yeah. See, that was the best thing about a Porto's, is it wasn't greasy. It was just like chicken cooked appropriately with not too much oil, and it was just nice. Um, yeah, like I used to get the Bondi. I think the Bondi was my favourite. So I had bacon and um, pineapple and stuff on it. It was really good. Oh my God, I'm sliding down. I can remember oh, um, my sister used to work at KFC and she used to always do the twisters. But what she would do is they used to have pineapple at KFC and she would have it, pineapple added to it with added barbecue sauce. Oh. And when I enjoyed having takeaway and KFC that was like my go it was so nice mm. but I don't eat that crap anymore I'm yeah. not I'm not silly I'm a slut for chicken in general <laughs> <laughs> hello is it Ango Gablo guy what's that icon oh my got? gosh you have got me uh, testing that <laughs> username I, can I just call you Andrew what's Andrew? that ice Andrew? What's that ice thing? Direct relief charity. Oh, oh, I love that. Oh, that's cool. Well, yes, you've come into the right stream at the right time because we are talking about chicken. <laughs> Though we don't eat it Kentucky anymore. Kentucky but... fried chicken. Yeah. You've had it from the source. That That's some serious stuff right there. <laughs> right, I made Ongo. my own chicken Caesar wraps on Saturday yeah, night. Yeah, on go. Alrighty, thank you. I correct that. Welcome in. Thank you for saying hi. I mean, it was more so uh, KFC, but I'll take that as a hi. <laughs> I'll take that as a hi. <laughs> that icon's so cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feel free to um, let me know Direct about the, the charity. charity. That would be, I'd love to know about okay. it. Go, Cowboy, 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 Oh, dude, I'm butchering it. <laughs> yeah, feel free to, like, you know... Literally just us. spell it out in every syllable, just like... Uh, uh, yeah, help uh, us uh, Aussies uh, out. Terrible. <laughs> Alrighty, I think we're looking okay for this lot now. I might go... Let's see how we go the next day. We do have a few babies come around this next round, but we also have this killer variant... Uh, this variant, not a killer one, and I don't think it should touch Sally. 
Telly should be well blended in and Syndrome should be fine. I think if he doesn't go next to Syndrome, we'll have to see. But we have so many um, healing kitty cats, it's not going to be a problem. Let's see how we go. Remember truth. Have you seen this game before, Ongo? Or are you just straight randomly... Straight to the children. Whoops. Of course he would. Have you seen this, this game before? I'm back at work for two days a week, so tomorrow. That's good, Ryan, because your leg was cooked. It was interesting, for sure. Don't overdo it, though, please. Oh. oh no. Disaster relief in Kentucky. We've got really bad tornadoes, so I don't I don't know how you guys That's do it. So like, beautiful. You yeah. guys get smashed with tornadoes over there. It's a crazy concept. We don't... We don't seem to get it over here. Like, we get the floods, we get the fires, but... Uh, the Maybe the dangerous animal spec kind of balances it out a bit. What do you reckon? Like, yeah, the fact yeah, that yeah, yeah. nearly everything on this, on this earth can... On this island can kill you in some kind of way. Or <laughs> There's a reason why we don't... Because imagine, if they're going to be like Sharknado. You know, like... <laughs> we just like all these fucking drop bears and stuff and this tornado just... Yeah, I don't know if I want to be a part of that tornado. No, Sharknado was terrifying. Not really, it was quite hilarious. I used to watch it when I was sick. But hey, maybe that's why I'm talking about it now. Lenta looks pretty cool with the purple eyes. This is like witch spec. I'm gonna call I'm gonna I'm gonna call her um I'm just gonna call her witch. <laughs> I could have been a little bit more creative uh, with her, but she is now just witch. Not really great in regards to blending in. She doesn't have the strength to take on a bear in her too, so she's kind of cooked. Um, but at least she looks cute. It'd be the Oprah of death, Ryan. It'd be like, you're going to die. You're going to die. You're going to die. We're all going to die. <laughs> Sounds like just simple chaos. Oh, absolute mayhem. Oh, dear. <laughs> Um, Crocs and Eastern Browns everywhere. Oh my gosh. Australia, man. We're, we're some hardcore shit. We are some hardcore shit. Hardcore shit. Yeah. I, I definitely agree with Eastern Browns, but I reckon like another animal, what would be like really cool instead of Crocs? Be like Redback Spider Shower. Yeah, 100%. Redback Spider Shower. <laughs> How's everyone feeling? They're feeling safe in this conversation? <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, Shazza and Rixen. They haven't, they've had two girls, but neither of them are like particularly, um, they don't have like particularly strong features. I think I want to try for one more between them just to see if we can get some more better adapted traits. We do need to deal with this. He's, he's spotted the cat that can't blend in and he's on a mission. Luckily we've got some ninjas around, but he's not going to get too far. Um, I also want to get Rosaya back over to Syro and they can have another Kittalink. Babies. We do have a few more babies. Oh my gosh, all the bird beaks coming through. These guys don't even have dominant bird beaks. How is it, how is it coming through? Oh, Barina snout. That's why the Barina snout's recessive and it's pushing the bird beak forward. Who's got the bird beak? Cool Cat's got the bird beak. Ah, there's the Berina snout. I see. So it's the grabbed the thickens. recessive of both Cool Cats and Nuku's. The mother chili clearly cheated with a bird. <laughs> KFC cheater. Wow. The, the colonel. Got the colonel. Gotta watch those pesky birds, man. The old colonel sex affairs. Oh my gosh. KFC cheater. Oh my god. <laughs> In all caps, by the way, too. It's not just KFC cheater. It's KFC cheater. Oh, gosh. Gosh, gosh, gosh. In fact, um, Ongo, it would be very, very late for you. Yeah, 100%. Isn't it getting late for you? Honestly, I couldn't think of a better game to fall asleep to. Like, like it's just a nice, chill game. Was it? Oh, yeah, yeah, true. That's a really good point. Like, if I was, like... Especially with these boys up. going off about, you know, whatever the heck they're talking about. It's super chill. Shit talking always puts everyone to sleep. Especially without <laughs> tea. Apparently. Apparently that's Wyatt. how it works. <gasps> Hello, Wyatt. Welcome in, darling. Good Hope you've been well. in your ear. Oh, thank you. Yes, he needs it really badly today. He gave himself food poisoning, so we've really got to flush his system. <laughs> How can bears do it? Yeah. Eat salmon. Oh, it's fresh there. I'm just a cool one. 
I just human. I do human things. Put a banana in your ear. Put a banana right into your favorite ear. It's true. It's true. So true. So true. Do you say what we did? We did a little run. We ran with it. What's going on here? What did you say? What white said? I can't stand the chat. I've been all right. Just playing with a friend right now and have been lurking for the past 20 minutes. Oh, oh, oh good, Dale. I hope your friend as well. What game are you playing? Still trying to um, get through that, that game that was kicking in, kicking your butt. <laughs> did we do anything fun on the weekend? Um, what did we do on the weekend? I wasn't particularly well on the weekend. Oh, that's so right. I was, was looking after watching. you on the weekend. Yeah, it's kind of interesting how the <laughs> roles have reversed. <laughs> yeah, Sunday, you were cooked. Yeah, like really I got cool. hit with the fever. I think I've got tonsillitis coming through, and the fever that cocked, cocked me. Cocked. And cocked me beforehand, apparently. Um, gave, yeah, kicked my ass. I was feeling pretty shitty. Yeah. So then the Sunday, we just kind of chilled it. Yeah. And now we over chilled it because now he's feeling bad today. So well, I'm glad that I'm feeling better today. Because then, if not, it would have been just like a shit storm of two people in bed going, Oh. <laughs> so it worked out quite well. Yeah, you sounded like you were dying enough, probably for the both of us today. Oh, hundred percent. He was he was feeling rough. Kai is adorable. Oh my gosh. We probably had a shit ton of watermelon over the past four days, though. Like, we have been eating a quarter of a watermelon probably every day, every day for the last like four days. The watermelons at the moment are like Top on tier. point. They are just oh, like the one you amazing. got last night. The, the, the rind on it, is it the rind? Was so thin. Like, yeah, it but like, I did find that the, the flesh that was near that was rind pretty was pretty tasteless. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was yummy. Well, White's been playing some Roblox. Still trying to get through the game. That is kicking my butt. <laughs> uh, that's probably why you had a break with Roblox, right? Yeah. Right now, yes, the typical cocked fever symptoms. Yeah, you gotta watch them, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta watch that tonsillitis. I've been cocked. Oh dear. Um, okay, well, I'm pretty happy with Kaya. Do I want to go one more to see if I can get... I don't know if I'd be able to get the um, berryness through. But we didn't get any poison fangs. We didn't get any of the tail, did we? No, we, we got... A lot of scorpion tails going on. I think I want to try one more with these guys because I'm really happy. Well, actually, they haven't given the genes that I want from them yet anyway. So I'll, I'll plan for another child with these guys when the time comes. Um, I still need to get her to meet up with her partner, but we should have... Oh, well, my baby. Yeah. Doctor, what seems to be the problem? I've been cocked. I've been cocked. <laughs> I can go in so many different ways. So like, really... <laughs> I right. want my mouse back. It's caught. I got it. Jacqueline. I crazy. You are crazy. Ruby Sire. I think I want to. Oh, she's very chocolatey. Rotisserie. She's got like a very. Isn't that like a like a bakery thing? That's what they put me on. No, no, no. Roast. Rotisserie. Rotisserie. Anyway, she's giving me like a caramel chocolate vibe. Let's call her a Claire. Nutella. No, like a like an eclair. With um corn chips in it. <laughs> that was actually a thing yesterday. We did experience someone eating a few people eating Nutella with uh, corn chips in it. Don't know if I'd recommend it, but uh, it, it, <laughs> hey, it's a thing. I thought that was right. You don't get a rotisserie chicken from a bakery. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh, buddy. Ow. Don't laugh. Don't make me laugh, Ryan. It just hurts his head. I've been cocked. He's been... <laughs> <laughs> what noise is running? What? I have not worked on my changeling story at all. Not yet. Wait, when the time comes, you'll get back into your flow. You got this. And, and, and like, if you want to go the horror theme... It, it's it's it hasn't been it hasn't been uh, oh, Halloween yet. Fuck it, come the shivers. He's so fucked, man. <laughs> 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 he 
<laughs> He's so broken. <laughs> you broken? Mm. Yeah? Yeah, I just got follicle erections. I'm stuck in one part because I don't know how to write it. Just like every story, just end it with, it was a dream. It was a dream. <laughs> <laughs> every English teacher's nightmare. And this is why he doesn't write stories. I remember in my, um, I think it was my English exam um, in HSE. Um, um, what did I do? Oh, yeah, I wrote the story to Happy Feet and I called it something else. <laughs> what did I call it? Dancing Feet is what I called it. Well done, well done. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have picked the difference. I don't know how my marks were. I didn't actually look at those ones. I just, all I cared about was my history one. Seven day old salmon. You are a wild man. Honestly, it's stupid. That's the best word for it. I don't know what possessed me. Mainly my hunger, I guess. Um, but I was like, you know what's gonna go good on this salad that we freshly made, which is no way of making me sick. Is putting some seven day old smoked salmon on top. Um, I don't know, I think it was a little smoked. It was smoked, though, James. Like, so, I guess that kind of smoked thing, kind of... Like, it was in one of those sealed smoked packages, like they do. So, it smelt... It smelt okay. And it probably was a little slimy in some spots, like a little. But... Yeah, they... they I did a big whoopsie. A little slimy in some spots, but it was fine. <laughs> yeah, James, I got bamboozled, man. <laughs> got bamboozled. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my gosh. Being a human's hard. Right, you guys are so, like, morbid and intense. Can we just... Calm down on the death, please. <laughs> Heaps of sympathy from Jack. Typical. A eh, James. She really knows how to lather it on. <laughs> He's a little bitch. A little he bitch. He done fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> you get no sympathy from me. <laughs> oh, dear. Alrighty, Miss Ruby. You are very much on your lonesome for someone who should be aware of uh, rogues. Well, you do you boot. Oh my gosh, she just found a feast. For She's my so English pleased. school certificate exam, my short story was kind of a mix of Final Destination mixed with Hunger Games. It was so gory and detailed, I had the principal talk to me with a counsellor. Still got an A though. God damn. Still got an A though. <laughs> my man. I'm a little worried about the influence that the Hunger Games uh, gave us overall. It was it was prettier on the morbid spectrum. I only watched the first one. I haven't seen it in the other side. This tree is only giving us one nut. Guess what's up? A single nut. What is this? It's cocked as, bro. It's a cocked as. <laughs> <laughs> Super cocked. Oh, dear. Alrighty. Who have we got down this end? I guess we can pop Ra here. Because that way we can see more shite. Have you been playing Overwatch 2, James? Yeah, what's the gossip? Yeah. When are you streaming? I heard that Andrew is Andrew's looking streaming. to start streaming uh, in the next few weeks. Hopefully, He's finally getting his shit together. I'll build my PC next week and I'll be on the freight train as well. We're good. Yeah, playing heaps of it. Nice. Who's good your, vibes. Is, uh, who's your mains at the moment? Who, who are you, who are you uh, using the most of? And the next year in English, I've given different classwork to do more special stuff, but I can't do anything using the imagination. Wow. It's a bit crazy, right? Ow. Been playing with. With A.A. Ron. A.A. Ron. Bambalam. Oh, Black Betty. Bambalam. I need to look at this. I didn't this know that Bam Bam played. He's been well? Good old Bambalam. Alright, we've got a, another baby to prep for. In fact, that means that more, all these guys are going to be having babies at the same time. But we do need to be aware we have another Berina! Ha <laughs> ha! Yay! Where's our friendly Berina? Isn't he meant to be protecting us? 
He's just bailed. He's like, no, nah, I'm too old for this shit. And he just left. I just love Junkrat, that game. Junkrat. I'm glad he's good. Junkrat, man. All right. What have we got here? We've got three, six, nine. I think, I think we can take this berry area out because it's just a normal berry So three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Get and that then mate. Get that mate. I might get Sally to pick it up so that we don't have problems with other berry <laughs> See, James, see if we work together, we'd be unstoppable. Nothing pisses me off more than that character. Every... <laughs> it's so good though. It's so satisfying. Like honestly, it's it's terrible to play against, but like I feel like if we queued up and then I played I played Junkrat and you played whatever character, we'd be unstoppable. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Even a bit of mercy. I'm a bit of a like a, a simple boy. Even mercy's good sometimes. Just running around and just healing. Why won't you release me? You got me begging you for mercy. Why won't you release? He's very much a capture player, though. Like, very, not not with the whole arm. Um... Yeah, I can't remember that game mode. Where you're pushing that thing along. He's very much a capture player, though. Um, the payload. Yeah, payload. That's it. Gotta push the payload. Gotta push the payload. Push it. Really? <sighs> push it. Man. Push it real good. Um, we have one more baby here that we need to organize. The little um, Kaya. <laughs> oh, yeah. You got me begging down on my knees. You got me begging, begging you for mercy. You got me begging, you got me begging. You got me begging. Mercy. Begging you for mercy. You got me begging. Down on my knees. Yeah. yeah, it hasn't stopped raining all day, Ryan. It's not crazy, but it's just rain. Northern River's got another good dose in, eh, James? Poor bastards, he cop it. It's just got nowhere to go. Do we still have a Lismore? Does Lismore still exist? <laughs> yeah, I nearly flooded it again. A few meters off in Lismore. That's so mental. That's insane. That's why you guys only just like got a break from it. You know, we had a shit ton of fires and now it's just like, you know what? We have a shit ton of floods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's a little bit of water anyway? Yeah, I watch out. That's way too much water on my cereal, <laughs> Satan. <laughs> it's too much water. Too much water on my cereal. You asked for it. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Third flood, it's never ending. Third flood. Gosh dang. This has been a big year. I like how it's raining in game and it's raining outside and it's raining up the coast and it's raining down the coast. Just won't stop fucking raining. The game is mocking us. Alright. Let's have baby boom. Babies! Oh, wait. No, someone's bleeding. No, it's Wayne. Oh. Wayne! It rains and plants regrow. Wow. That's some serious shit right there. Alrighty, babies. What y'all doing in my hood? Hey, we finally ended up getting um, our uh, poison fangs, though, which is kind of what I was after on this uh, third child of theirs. Red, fiery, big ears, hammer tail, spots. Oh my gosh, blue eyes. She's fierce. She does need a name, though. Fierce name that represents Ladybug. A fierce name. I reckon it's pretty fierce. I want to fuck with a Ladybug. Yeah. Ugh. Ooh. Uh, uh, uh. I am looking pretty happy with these traits. 
Got enough attack to attack a killer berina and poison them. Not a big attack, but the poison is really important. We've got the ability to nearly completely blend in. We just needed the stripes, but that's okay. We can work on that. But overall, I'm really quite happy with that uh, child. Let's see, I was wanting to try and get the K from Cool Cat. Do we have any other K babies? No, Cool Cat's the only one with the K gene. She hasn't given any of it away yet. So we're gonna try for another baby with these guys to see if we can get the K gene. Cool. But Ladybug's pretty damn cool. Cool, thanks baby cock. That's naughty. Oh, I have to lie down again. Is Huddy whinging at a truck being here? Or the truck at the front? Oh. Who, who knows? Who knows? All right, next baby. Oh yeah, I'm oh, liking these lighter colors. Waking up again. What? <laughs> you look so rough. <laughs> oh dear. I feel it. Drinking water. I've been drinking waters. I've never eaten salmon again. <laughs> oh. Fucking oh, blind. Oh dear, Ryan. Um, I. He looks fierce. He looks like. Cobra Kai. Like from, um. Karate Kid. We could call him Cobra. Mm. He does kind of have, like, not the full pattern of the Cobra of the tail, but I reckon it's kind of fierce and cool. The purple eyes just have a vibe to it. I've got a Cobra with a K, though. Yeah, you do a castle. Okay. <laughs> The pangs. It's the pangs. Yeah. All right, well, we finally got the J gene at least, but I don't know if we need any more homie gene. How many homie? Yeah. We've got a few, so I might let off Cyro's homie gene being passed on, and I might let these guys have a break from breeding. I think I'm pretty happy with where we've been going with their genes. I think I can, I think I can. Because then... Did they have a girl though? Oh no, they haven't had a girl. She's red. Is there any other red females? I think we all had unique females, didn't we? Okay, well I need to keep reading them until I get red. Don't stop. Don't stop. Believe it. You can't stop with them. Oh, I've already got that. Let's make them blue then. Do we have any blue? I think there's no blue. We just need blue. We've got the light blue, not dark blue. Okay. That works out then. Um, We need to try and get a female from them if we can. Uh, And then we go to um, next baby. Hello there. Oh my gosh, he is cute. He's got like a, a bit of a fiery Simba vibe. Mm, call him Frank. Nice. I think it's very fitting. He's bold. I like his colors. He's like, you want to bring me on? Bring me on. I'll take you out of my little deformed paw, bish. Because he's got deformed paw. He's actually, uh, other than the stripes, I don't know how well he's going to be going, but at least he looks cute. At least he looks cute. Um, he's got the H gene, so we don't need to worry about the H gene anymore. Um, but I don't think any of these guys have that I gene, but I think we've got a few I genes circling now. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that I gene, so I think I might, <coughs> might let these guys have a break from breeding as well. Can't stop the dick to the shin dick. All right, and then I might pop these guys just sneakily out of the way. Um, I guess we can. That's like, oh, now we're going to get the female sitting there. Okay, and then we've got one more here. We've got another black cat, but this one's got white horns. Cool, black cat. And we got a cool cat. Why can't we have a black cat? She's pretty cool. I I, I like her. <laughs> She's badass. Um, she doesn't have 
she's okay. She seems like we're getting like a, a trend with these guys. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna give these guys a break. Shads is not bringing through her jeans, and it's upsetting me a little bit. Have you bought any tickets? Any lotto tickets for the 160 million? No, I don't gamble. Not interested. Leave it to you, crazy. You crazy people. I do want a Porsche. <laughs> Porsche would be pretty good. <gasps> Hold on. You're out of luck. Yeah. It's coming back. You look a little bit like a potato. It's coming back. Yeah. This screen probably isn't helping. <laughs> he looks so defeated. Oh my precious. <laughs> Shut up. So supportive. Oh, you look like shit. You do look like shit. Yeah. You look rough, bro. When did I have pounded all last time? When was that? What time was that? Maybe around 10. Maybe 11. Yeah, I probably, think it was closer to 10. I'll be better off taking it before I go to sleep than now. Oh. Oh, you can just not eat rotten salmon. I don't want to eat salmon ever again. I'm going to eat barramundi and make sure it's in date. I'm going to crumb it. And some chips. Oh, chips. <gasps> oh! Wedges. What? We've got a little, we've got a little friend. What's his name? I, I don't know. We need to go in and meet him. Her? Him. Alright, does anyone want to... Ooh. Okay, let me see what I can guess here. We've got a boy. Oh, claw. He's got the claw. He's got runner leg, runner, uh, runner foot, long snout, spiky body, normal ears. What car? Oh, what color do we reckon he would be? I reckon he's brown. We don't even have like a fish and chip shop in Warhope anymore. We don't. Oh, fish and chips. Yeah. I never used to eat the fish and chips there anyway. But you, you just get charcoal chicken. And you get chips there. And then the fish is a little cart now. They've, they've like, they didn't want to pay rent anymore. So now they're in a little cart. All right, Rickson. Who have we got here? What oh, color wow. is he? I mean, he's the lightish brown. <laughs> It's got brown in oh there. wow. He's interesting. Terror. Oh my gosh. I guess with all those spikes it's quite fitting. He's very gentle and subtle in all his other coloration except for his spikes. Let's call him Franklin. Let's call him Franklin. <laughs> I do have a question of curiosity. Is he able to breed with Lemya? Because I wanted to breed her, but I couldn't because none of the boys could. But these guys. Oh my gosh, I think I just found Perfect. a breeding partner. <gasps> That's an echidna. I agree. Yay! Well, well, we've got a, an echidna breeding partnership now. And that's going to help us getting those uh, 10 breeding opportunities. He's, yeah, he's got some strength on him at least. So it's going to help him with the killer barina problem. And he blends in a little bit. I think he's going to be a very useful additive to the team. And Lemmy's only just down here, so she might as well like pop over and, and kind of get some D. Get some D. I'm going to get them ready to breed with each other with their genes, but obviously I can't just do it till the next turn. Um, I think I want to give him Vetifertility, and I th think I want to focus on maybe good eyesight. So the fertility, the eyesight. And then Lemya, she needs to get horns and she needs to get rid of that food. All right, so let's go. I reckon she'd be antlers. And I think I want to give her... It's quite fragile. Oh, you gotta go lie down. Yeah. You're getting pretty bad. Yeah. Alrighty. See you, stream. See you later. He's gonna go have another rest and I'll lay down. Because he's broken. Because he made a bad life decision. 
Oh. Kids, don't do what he did. Don't eat salmon. James, they feel better, buddy. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Ow. Have Holy a good poopy. Shit. Holy shit. Yeah, wow, it's hitting him now. Okay, you gonna do you, want, you want me to shut the door? No, I want to listen to your stream. Okay, he wants to listen to my stream whilst he sleeps. I sleep by listening to stream. <laughs> he sleep by listening to stream. He's a bit cute. I sleep by He's a bit cute. <laughs> oh, darling. Drink your water, please. Help me, you're dying. <laughs> Uh, Brian better head off to Woolies and stock up on toilet paper. <laughs> Jump over that. He hasn't been poopy. He hasn't been poopy. He's just storing all the toxins instead, and it's giving him the worst headaches. I don't know what his body, whether his body's doing him a, a service at all. Like, like at all. <laughs> Is this real life? Oh my gosh. He's in the chat. All right. He's still here, guys. You can't get rid of him that easily. He refuses. <laughs> It'll hit him soon. I love the good omens you're sending him. So much support, guys. <laughs> All righty. How are we looking with this crazy bunch? I think I want Kai... Oh my gosh, so many fish there. None of these guys can fish though. I get a wall. Um, where's the rest of the crew you going? I forgot which here. He's actually going to be one of our mystic snow babies. Which looks so cool. Even though she doesn't have any traits that are useful. This is beneficial. By the fact that she just looks freaking cool. Um, so I might get her... Might just get her sneak into the bushes here. Oh, there's meat there. Oh, the bearina got it. Well done, friendly bearina. Good job. All right, we've got a Claire here. Um, we've got Moja here. Guess you can kind of just keep doing. Gotta be careful where I put him. I wouldn't mind. Oh, Tyra can actually get there. Maybe we'll just let him try and get the take out. Okay, now we've got the opportunity to take that guy out. Nice. In fact, none of Tyra's kids really look like him. These are all Tyra's kids. They all look more like their mum. And then we might get a Claire. She's just going to pop into, yeah, the grasslands. There. We're, we're clearing this pretty quickly. Alright, when I was in high school, I used to drink curdled, oh, curdled milk with lemon juice to make myself throw up to get out of, get out of going to school. Ryan, that's dedication, man. Ugh. That would be so bad for your system. <laughs> so bad for your system, man. Your poor, like, throat. But hey, that's dedication. They like, kudos for that. Dedication. <laughs> All right, Sally, I might get you to start doing some more exploring as well. Um, Mickey. Let's get L'Oreal. I should go in there and do some exploring as well. And then we've got Syndrome here. Who I guess might as well follow. Long poo is here. Clearing that space out. Boy, I don't think he wants to go too far from his mum. I might let him stick nearby. And then I think that's everyone that can move. How are we going? We're, we're clearing a fair bit of it. We should be able to move off this island pretty quickly. Um. And then we're going to deadly jungle, so that's reassuring. 
Um, but I think I think I'm gonna have a break from niche. I might pop in and see how my sim family is going, but I might need to go get something to nibble on food-wise, maybe. Um, if you're still alive, babe, is the banana still there? Probably, yeah. You didn't eat the banana? No. <laughs> Cheers. Put a banana in your ear. Put a banana right into your favorite ear. All right. True. So true. <laughs> I, I come with what are you doing? You're meant to be sleeping. I have a banana for you. That's going in your ear. <laughs> Go to bed. You look so fucked, man. <laughs> like, you legit look pale. Thanks. You're starting to look ghastly. Oh, really? Like, grey in the face. Maybe this is where I pass on. This is where I pass on. He's very dramatic. He's fine. It's been nice work. He's been very dramatic. He'll be fine. Around desperate times call for desperate measures. I'm surrounded by dramatic men. Oh, my gosh. He needs more water. Oi, drink your water. Oh, okay. He said, oh, okay. Oh, and, and and he's also saying plain toast. Plain toast? Who said plain toast? Ryan. Oh. He's bathing you. He just looks broken. <laughs> and do you know how unusual that is? Yeah, him not eating is a little weird. Alrighty, I'm going to... Um, Pop out of niche. I think we've done a pretty good sesh with the niche. 